Hello, TruthSeeker666 here. Just a quick video to say to you, if you're absolutely pissed off uh, beyond any recognition with Windows updates that happen when you least expect it or don't want it or in the middle of the night, that wreck your machine, that stop things working, that take things that were working and mangle them up, and then you can't really work out what's going on, like hardware devices will stop working, the machine might stop working, everything may stop working. If you don't like this sort of stuff, it's probably because the Windows updates are changing things that were working for things that are now broken. And as we all know, why fix it if it ain't broken? Now, some people would say, well, you need Windows Update because it does stuff for security. It does stuff for security. It's for your help. It's security. It's to make bug fixes. It's to make it better. And some of us know that a lot of these updates are actually to purposely cripple software because they've been asked to do that by the people that make the software. Uh, specifically, device drivers. Where companies no longer wish to support a particular product, they will ask Microsoft to withdraw it. So it will stop the product working. Um, this has happened with device drivers for reprogramming kit that I've got for radios. Um, if you don't do any updates and you install the drivers, you can use the hardware. And then if you allow Microsoft updates to go and update, it'll go, oh, these device drivers. No, 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 no. The manufacturer doesn't want you having those. And it will bollock it up. So don't be in any, you know, don't be, don't be fooling yourself if you're thinking that Microsoft are being your friend by doing updates. Quite often it leads to heartache and tears and uh, trips to computer stores to get your PC fixed. And uh, there are some things in this world that uh, System Restore doesn't fix. So anyway, the solution to it is Windows Update Blocker. Um, get it from this site, sawdom.org. And you scroll down until you see where it says Download. You click on Download and you install it. And then you unpack the install. And then on my desktop, I have the files I need. WUB64 if you have a 64-bit operating system. So this program here, double-click it. It's so simple. You just click on Disable Updates, Protect Service Settings, and Apply. And then the service status will change to a red X, which means you no longer have updates from Windows. Isn't that nice? Now you're in control of your own machine. You can control your own destiny, not Microsoft. You can have things that continue to work forever not Microsoft deciding to shut things down overnight. Great. And if you're doing a talk on a stage with a laptop with PowerPoint, when you open that laptop up to go and do your presentation, you can now, with confidence, know that you are not going to have it doing updates for half an hour before you can start the machine and then crashing the machine so you can't do your you, you couldn't do your presentation either way yeah thank you microsoft thank you what's the point of having a machine if you can't just open it up and use it yeah yeah microsoft well done microsoft well done microsoft but anyway windows update blocker has got your back so check it out